I'm making Shabbos for 11 this week. It's Friday and it's time to get ready for Shabbos. After a few days away, we arrived home late Thursday night and I immediately rushed to the supermarket to buy everything I needed to cook for Shabbos today because somehow my original planned two Shabbos guests turned into six. And that combined with my family of five brings us to a total of 11 people in my house for Shabbos this week. To be fair, three of those people are small children who probably won't eat very much, but still, that's 11 people for Shabbos, which is two large meals and one smaller one. If it looks like I cooked more than usual this week, it's because I did. Luckily, I had things like challah, soup, and potato kugel in the freezer, and I was really organized, writing my cooking and shopping lists on the plane, so my midnight shopping trip took about 15 minutes total in the store, and I was ready to get cooking first thing Friday morning. I made lots of kid-friendly favorites like my crummy chicken, roasted potatoes, and apple kugel this week, along with pesto chicken, roasted sweet potatoes, broccoli, string beans, and a large chillin'. No one's going hungry. We have plenty of cookies in the freezer for dessert, but I decided to make this s'mores pie that I've been making often lately because it's easy and popular. I keep getting requests for the recipe, and it's not mine to share, but you can find it in my friend Connie Applebaum's best-selling cookbook, Millennial Kosher, along with the delicious cowboy biscotti that I made the other week.